Just because I'm 68 doesn't mean to say that I have to stop learning. I've tried this app called um, Couch to 5K. I've never run in my life. For diet, we made some changes because my partner was diagnosed with high cholesterol. And over the nine weeks, I finally managed to run uh, continuously for 30 minutes, which was really great achievement, you know, and a great sense of pride as well. So every day I'd walk 10,000 steps um, around the local area. And that has changed. And that's quite useful because I'm beginning to notice things in the local area where I live that I hadn't done before. I don't know if you've heard of the LIFT programme. So I've been doing that for five years every Wednesday and it really kept me fit. We talked about how we were going to deal with the first lockdown and we were allegedly allowed out for an hour a day. Um, we did. Uh, we went out religiously every day for a walk and the hour has now developed into an hour and a half. In the summer we're elder granddaughter came to stay with us for a while and she got us back into swimming. So I now, uh, four mornings a week from half seven to half eight. For two months I cooked something different every day for dinner and I'm happy to say that it brought the cholesterol level down. When I decided uh, to um, become vegan then I wanted to do it properly. I didn't want to just eat processed foods that had the vegan label. I wanted to learn to, to cook in very, very different ways. My dad isn't good because I live alone, but what I've been trying is to maybe introduce uh, more fiber into my diet. I love cooking food. I like uh, exploring different kinds of food. And I think that's another thing that keeps you wanting, you know, I think making you feel not very old is because you're open to exploring. Nourishing your mind, nourishing your body, you know, being kind. It's a foolish person who thinks they know everything. You know, you, you have got all those other things like factors that might inhibit you, you know, from leading a good quality of life. Um, you need to know where, what they are. You need to strike them off. 